Howdy, howdy, howdy. How are you guys doing it today? We're going to do some Vampire Survivors. And then when it's 7 o'clock or 50 minutes from now, we're going to swap on over for Raid Night. Hopefully Raid Night goes well. And we'll do our re-clears. And everybody can look at the strange shapes and colors and explosions. And we'll see how it goes from there. And if we clear that early, oh, no, we'll probably swap back to Vampire Survivors or something. But... Uh, Let's go play some vampires, shall we? Hi. Link, thank you. It's very appreciated you using your prime gaming here. Hmm. Yeah. So, we are going to play. I have uh, gone through and unlocked uh, a, a few people. Thank you for the meat. <laughs> I'm curious to see how everyone else plays, because everyone's, like, interesting, I guess, and stuff. Uh, do I want to do old man build? I don't know. I don't think I want to do old man. Let's do permanent HP and max health. Start with temporary area bonus. Huh. Uh, start with one more revival. Gains more revival. One more revival at 33. Huh. Okay. Permanent. Hmm. What's the bone do? Hmm. Yato Clavo. Sure, let's do the giant bear. And I, I guess we'll start at the tower and see how it goes. Hi, Munchie. Okay, so to the south are some items, to the north are some items. There's specifically the thing that I needed to get. Right, we wanted to get the specific thing. Oh. Yeah, let's let's give the panda bear some water. And Yeah, the candelabra. Pans from Juju Kaisen. Juju Jujitsu Kaisen. That is a difficult name to pronounce. see so when they explode they give off this cute little aoe that does a bunch of stuff i see i see so you want to try and shoot them in ways that like get them oh they're cherry bombs that's why so they explode okay and they explode into cherry blossoms oh i see i see Okay, okay, I, I see where the gimmick is. Yeah, there's definitely some DPS woes here. Fifty percent chance to explode. What do you mean? They weren't already exploding. The explosion really does. If you can get it to play nice, work really well for you. Hmm. 
I feel too large and gassy and sassy. Oh, that, that took a chunk out of me. Also, we need more projectiles with these. These things don't do enough. Oh, they're not guaranteed to explode, I see. Hmm. Interdasting, though. You can really do some interesting work with these. Oh, that's some powerful Santa water. Hold up. Suddenly the Santa water wants to do some work. Yeah, no, crowding up against a wall like this, the explosion does a lot of clearing out for you. Like, the Santa water gives you a little bit of initial breathing room, but the explosion's what really f finishes it off. It really gives it the panache. Uh, does the grimoire say what the cherry bomb pairs with? I don't know. I don't know. Don't know if the cherry bomb does pair with anything. You summon more men. Oh, you summon a lot of men. Oh, I got my butt destroyed. All right, we'll try again. More chance to explode, okay. Yeah, just 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 up the whole everything of this. Just just make these things just explode. Oh yeah, duplicator. Duplicator's a no-brainer. Just just make a million explosions like everywhere, please. So you are talking about ghost malls? Well, I'm actually in a not ghost mall right now. Oh, that's cool. I hope you have fun in your regular mall or a mall that is full of friendly ghosts that, that is normally populated just with a lot of ghosts. A perfectly fine and safe mall for humans that coincidentally just has a bunch of ghosts. Oh, I'm getting my butt eaten again. And I'm alive somehow. Okay. Okay, I guess this is where I die. Yeah. Oh good, I dropped a chest. Alright, let's start with somebody who's got an item that can actually do some work. Yeah, let's go old man. Do I want to go old man? Uh, I'd go with a girl. Yeah, we'll go Gallo again. Do I have anything I could buy with uh, the power-ups? 500 bucks. Nah, everything's expensive. Uh, let's go you. Let's, let's, hit him, let's slap him with a nun. Slap him with a nun! But yeah, I hope you have fun.
Let's go Bibble. Oh my god. The nun is huge. Yeah, that temporary area up bonus, uh, she kind of slap. Alright, that temporary area up bonus has left us. It didn't even last a minute. But it did last us long enough. Yeah, I'm not too keen on the cherry bombs, though. They didn't seem to work out all that well for us. The Bibles seem to be doing a little bit of work, though. Triple Bible! Your Sunday school doesn't have enough Bibles for me. Miss 30 seconds of pet- did it not pet me? Oh, thank you for the pets. Weird. Alright, thank you. Or did it not, like, just do the pets and- no, the Sa Sammy does the pets. Um... What the heck? Pet the Abra, could not identify Hotkey. I am in my proper model, right? What the heck? Hold up. Pet the Abra. That is the hotkey ID. goes. Weird. Okay. Strange. Yeah, and some weird software gore there. Don't know why it, uh, oh no, it read the token to a file, but it never actually, like, properly read it. What the heck? Whatever. <sighs> I'll take the luck. The Bible makes work of, like, the closed people, but, like, once the water is up and running, that'll be very powerful. The Bible does good, though. Wow, who knew? The Bible does good. It's crazy, isn't it? Speed and... yeah. I want faster Bibles! And I'm gonna start bumping luck too. Hi Guru, how you doing? I'm not sure if we're talking about the same Bible. The Bibble. I'm talking about the Bible in this game. Uh I don't want the lit Yanny. Yanny Laurel. Wonder if they named it that just to like anger people who were like mad about the Yanny Laurel discussion. They could have named it like mistletoe or something like that. Because they already have Santel water, you know? So you could have named the item mistletoe and been fine, but naming it a laurel. But I guess like resting on your laurels is sort of like, you know, a thing, so. I guess it makes sense. 
Um. Yeah, give me longer lasting moisture, please. The holy water does its job pretty good. Man gets hit with a book. Oh, hey, free chicken. But welcome, welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing well. Uh, do I want the bird? I don't know what synchronizes the birds together, but you know what? Uh, let's go birds. Let's promote birds. We'll see if we can get the other bird, too. This gosh darn wizard! Many DPS options, but it doesn't. If you could just stop hitting me. <sighs> you boss. You actual factual boss. Alright, if the skeletons could chill for a moment, that'd be cool. Oh yes, hot breath. Yes! Hit him with the Wario! Another Bible. Yeah, we just need raw damage. Oh god, the skeletons come back! This is brutal. This is brutal. The Abbey noises didn't fire. Am I crazy? Did you? Oh! Token has expired. One second. Yeah, no, what the heck? Did, like, everything de-off? So there's the Abbey noise. Why did, um... I should have been thrown... I should have been hit with meat, is that... What the heck? 
Why did everything fall apart? Is Twitch just busted on me? Um, is taking voice mod? Oh, voice mod must have done some weird thing. Okay, what? Weird. Is it better now? God, everything broke! What the fuck? What the hell? God, the red skeletons coming back sucks. It's like they keep approaching when they're dead, too. Tarona. Um, I need the bird, so I can't take that yet. Ow! Hi, Robert William. How you doing? Physical violence and is a form of comedy. I think. I don't know, man. Tom and Jerry. Gotta go to the mall's Mario Kart tournament. I wonder how many ghost types we'll be playing. Well, it depends if they're going to be using the CPU ghosts. The chorus goes. A lot of money. At least we're rich. Oh, I don't want you. Yeah, just give me more water. I've got a beefy amount of luck, anyway. Please. Just a single bird, sad. But yeah, no, if something is wrong or something, please tell me so I can fix it. I at least know I got hit with a metal pipe. I, I guess that works. Yay, Abra noises work. Y yay. This little old lady who lived in a shoe didn't have enough DPS to get on through. Ugh. 
up all damage, please. Like, eventually we'll start one-shotting things. Until then, I guess we suffer. Please, just, just, just give me the gems. Let me out of here! <laughs> that works. That'll help. That'll help a ton. More Bibles! More Bibles! Quad Bible! Alright, cool. We should have some mad DPS from this super holy water. Labada. Takes a second to kick on, but once it does... Now. Yeah. Upgrade my Bible. What is the Bible open with? The uh, Bible unknown item. Wow. If I could get the Bibles out the whole time, like, that'd probably be the most powerful thing here. Yeah, just keep Bibles active at all times. Oh, Ebony, thank you. Cool. We don't have to worry about weapons showing up now, so we should just get passives and weapon upgrades. That gives us a bit of help. Oh, time stopper. Yes. Just start chewing through people, please. we from the we're not even at the fist yet oh, duplicator yeah duplicator always strong duplicator is just always a dps bump a bad, like, a very powerful DPS bomb, too. Hi, Dragon Cat. I'm vibing. Vam, vibe, fire, survivor. Yeah, let's start upgrading our birds. Tractor, Bible, Candelabra. Some pretty powerful Bibles. All right, we've maxed out our Bible. <sighs> cool. All right, let's just keep beating crap up. Cross-space damage would be nice. We just need things. We just need things. 
Ooh, touch controls. Don't care. Yeah, let's get our birds upgraded. Our birds need some uh, potency. Oh, hey, Jesus. Thank you. Toronto's box. I'll take it. I'm curious to see what it does. We just have to not take it for anything else. Because, like, once it's at max level, like, our, our run becomes pain. But everything else should be nice until we get to max level. Oh my god. The amount of crap that is here right now. Protestantism, there were no survivors. About appropriate for... We need to start heading north, like hardcore. God damn, we destroy as we go through here, though. Yeah, just hit the Bible button and then, uh, you know, do our thing. Excuse? Yeah, the Bible is doing the best work right now. Um... Let's just hit some damage buttons. We need to start clicking the birds when we see them. Oh, I'm getting my butt eaten. These are not the birds that I want. I don't want harpies. Are we near the... Alright, we're close to the thing. And the character that comes with it. Yeah. Just, just, we're just focusing on birds right now. Good thing is we only see upgrade stuff, so we'll just get some upgrade stuff. Very strong. Green gems. I'll take it, I'll take it. We've, we've got DPS alpha. That's what I was afraid of with this girl. She doesn't really do a lot of DPS super strong. But she's doing it now. She's doing it now. Yeah, she's doing it now. God, if I find, like, the Omega Attractor, but this is over. There's so much EXP I had to leave behind. It's over there. I need it. <laughs> Give it to me. Oh, thank God. Cool. We've got the cool thing. Okay, so what does this do? Healing is doubled. Recovering HP damages nearby enemies for the same amount. Okay. It doesn't affect anything that I currently have, but that works. And there's also a uh, chest up here, I guess, too. Yeah, there's a there's a guy up here. We should probably get them. Oh, oh, okay. 
I see. Get me a wall chicken, everybody gets hurt. It's like a little Jesus. It's a sub-Jesus. Hit me again with that chicken. Yeah! Yeah, chicken! More bird. There's a person up here. I need to see him. Don't know who you are, dude, but I'm seeing this person up here. We've missed the person up here. Woo! Big one. Okay. A couple of tract orbs, a couple of axes, and a range up. Or size up for everything. I'll take it, I'll take it. It's not the greatest, but it works. Cheeky. Bird. miss the person I, I keep missing this person there is a person trapped somewhere that I am just horrible at finding I died okay I uh, bring it back now y'all oh, they're around here somewhere Am I crazy? Check the mirror to the left. Am I blind? Check the mirror to the left. I don't see a mirror. Oh. Oh. Hello. Oh. Oh, excuse me. There are men. There were men. Not anymore. All right. Who's this? Conceta Kakyota. Okay. Neat dude. Can I can I go home? How do I go home? Oh, okay. Let me go home. Dastardly creature! Denizen of the night! Uh, how many wings is a couple levels out, but we'll get there by the time we get down there. The bird's almost leveled up, though. It's a couple chickens we missed at some point, but it's whatever. Let me in, meme. Let me in. Let me in. I'm surrounded by dudes, yeah, I should probably be a bit more careful. I was kind of relying on Bible action. There we go. Gay birds! Oh, right, Scythe too, I guess.
Gotta be careful with that. The good thing is, we're powerful enough we can just kind of walk downstairs. This nun slaps. I guess you could say none can stand up to her. Yeah, we've got a bit to go. I see that purple chest. I'm not risking it. Hell yeah, bird up. Bird up. Ah, at this point we just keep going south and see what we find. Oh wait, there's another thing up here. Uh, the problem is, this is uh, not going to give us a lot, but... Yeah, we'll get us the sword. Which works. Yeah, we've got we've got the DPS right now. So we just head south and cause problems. Um what weapon combos with the bracer? Knife to with thousand edge. Eh, it's something. Well, this is going to be something. Not as much as I thought it would be. Um, can I get south enough to get the... I don't know, we'll see. There's chicken in the way, though. Which is always nice. At least I got chicken. Bird can upgrade, yeah. Which is nice. Which makes me think there's a level beyond regular bird. Can upgraded items get upgraded again? Like, do they have a level beyond? Hmm. Questions for later. Yeah, manticores are getting pretty much bodied. Probably want to stick to this open area just so I can actually deal with the manticores, though. Alright, big crab! I need to keep the crab to the north! Ugh, it sucks.
At least I got Rendasmo, which is, like, big, because that gets me all of the Arcanas. Yeah. Oh, now I have the ability to banish. Yes. Cool. There's a lot of good stuff, just getting the ability to banish. Alright, well, we gotta swap over to XIV, so we will do that. But that was fun. It's time for Raid Night. Or... Oh, never mind. Raid is uh, pushed till tomorrow because there's some lag issues with uh, one of our raid members. We're back into Vampire Survivors. Never mind. Oh, well, that's a thing, I guess. We're going back to the vampires. Never mind. Uh, am I still getting pet? Did the pets never end? You've been pet oh my god! There, I, I fixed it. Endless head pets. Look, whoever redeemed those head pets, you've been getting value. I demand a hug. No, not again! <laughs> Uh, it wasn't you who redeemed them. No. Ah! You still demanded a hug, so I give it. Okay. Got hugged by my boyfriend. How dare he? Uh. Um. All right. Sure. We could try one of the DLC areas. Um, let me poke for you. Hey, uh, you free to consult on vampires tonight, at least until you go live. I'm going to just hop in my server then, I guess. We'll see if anyone else who knows vampire survivors can hop in and join the streaming chat. I need I need assistance. Oh, there's milk. Alright, we've got two arcanas. We've got the divine bloodline. Armor also affects listed weapons damage and reflects enemy damage. Character gains bonus damage depending on missing health. Being enemies with gives you max health. Oh. Or healing. We'll go with this one, I guess. Ugh. We'll go with the one, too. Because we need something, because we're not always going to be looking at an enemy, so we need something that will just deal with that for us. The ability to reroll isn't going to be nice. And hey, we can take the box and not worry about it going up to, like, max level. Because now we've got the Abanish ability, so the next time when we see Box at like level 9, we can uh, hit it. Or at level 8. We just get all the bonuses of the box without the fear. Oh, I love being a gamer. Oh, I love being gay. <laughs> LGBT gaming. Why is that like a? Th Why am I doing this? 
Why am I doing this? Oh, good. One boner. I can just pop the box. Curse increases level up rate? Yeah. That's why I'm getting it early. Uh, it goes to Christmas Future. How you doing? Like, it increases the level up rate, but, like, the problem is it doesn't come in at the end. So I'm wondering, like... I'm wondering then, like, what's the best way to deal with it? It's like, if, if we can keep the DPS up, then we'll be fine. It's just keeping the DPS up. I wish the knives did backwards as well. And I know they shoot where you're going to be, but if they, like, shot backwards as well... Like the whip, but controllable, I guess. There's still a lot I need to learn about this game, though. Memorize all the, uh, things. <laughs> sure, more knives! I'm as happy as a guy with many knives. <coughs> Yo, more knives! Yeah, they pass through enemies. I'll take it, I'll take it. Because, here's the thing, we're going right for the glove. Like... Cause it's like on the map, so we might as well. Free glove. Hey, Thori. How many Arcana did you get? I'm guessing you can get more than one of those cards. But... I hate that they die, and then they come back, and then they're actually dead. And they can do damage while they're still, like, reforming, you red bastards. The, the skeletons are communists! Yes, tell me. Reduce the cooldown. I, I want to go fast. I want to go fast. I want to be never-ending problems. Duplicator. Then, like, I'm still at the point where I'm unlocking things, so I don't know if I actually want Curse to just kind of do the swag hyper run, or if I'm just like, I don't know, immune with <laughs> calcium. Better bony than lonely, I guess. Is that what the kids say now? Um... We'll go with the cross, yeah. Cause here's the thing, like, the whip's great on, like, the library, but that's it. Like, you want stages where you've got that left-right 
ability. Yeah, we got a couple. We've got a bit before we see the the box show up, so we're in a place where we're kind of chill. Yeah, we still got a while to go before Red Fist. These fuckers. Um, do I want to do guns? Uh, what do guns pair with? So left gun, right gun, and something else makes something. Don't know what, but I guess we'll find it at some point. We'll keep our guns open for now. But this is the man of many projectiles, so, like, you know. Literally, like, what his life is about is just doing this. Alright, cool. We can start going to south now. And hopefully we can get there before the crab battle happens. But this this knife dude's pretty fun. He he's a he's pretty strong. Up the base damage of the knives, sure, why not? Like we weren't already causing enough problems for these bastards. Combos, yes, yeah, so we should. But we're 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 hot on DPS right now, which is nice. Plus getting luck just means we get more like attract orbs and fun stuff. You know? Spicy cakes, things to get us out of uh, hairy situations. Alright, cool. We're at the point where the knife will Evo when it's time. It's not going to be time for a bit, but whatever. Oh, okay. We're hot. We're hot. Damn, that's a lot of Jesus. And a Hitachi. Don't you remember that part of the Bible? Where Jesus got his magic wand out and cured the sinners? It's a hell of a good book. We still got two weapon slots, so we'll see if we can find the other gun. More gun. We got a bunch of other crap to upgrade regardless. Plus, we're kind of destroying ass right now, so like, we're, we're good. Yeah, no, we are Animal Crossing Isabel rip and tear until it is done.
I do have weapon slots, but I want to keep one open for the gun, and then I guess... What does the... What does the gun TF with, or do I just not have the ability to do that, so I just get two guns, I guess? Cake? Oh, I don't think I have the, I've seen the cake. Tiramisu? Yeah, no. I don't know if that's just, you know, get to a stage or have a special character or something. And then you get Tiramisu. Or if it only shows up once you've gotten... ...a certain requirement. But I don't think I've ever seen the Tiramisu. Hose the 10 minute boss. And now she's been 10 minute bodied. Ooh. That's a lot of knives. Fires with no delay. <laughs> I am a god. Alright, yeah, no, we're, we're done. We're done here. Pack it up. I don't know, are there are enemies in my way? I can't tell, there's just death. What do you do? Oh, that's how I get more. Can I just pick one? No, it just gives me that one. Okay. So I have the armor one now, I guess. Yeah, no, I don't get to see, like, what they do while I'm in this screen, so... I guess I just get the the armor one and the health one because they're the only ones I've got. Yeah, no, this is just... This is just walking simulator. Fist. I, too, can be upgraded via cake. You know? That's life advice right there. Sometimes all you need in life to upgrade yourself is a little cake. So we need the other gun. More gun. Um, I'll just keep the luck up for now. Our DPS is fine. It probably won't be fine forever, but like, it's fine for now.
is made to order, but it isn't to be read. When they open it up, they're sucked inside instead. The magic land of I am me. Ah, uh, good old YouTube poop reference no one gets. Yeah, sure, we'll do lightning ring. Now that's not a cake right there, is it? No, that's a different type of box. Do I get the cake at the milk factory? It makes sense. Additional Jesus. Um, so Jesus is upgraded all the way. Magic Wand needs one more and then it's on Vibrate. We're looking for the gun companion. This is a heavy wave, guys. Y'all cool? Like, like is everything all right? These knives, man. These knives do work. Oh, okay. That's a hot zone. Way too hot for me. Do I tempt fate? I wonder if I can actually take the 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 Torona or like the 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 Pandora's box level nine. And just be like, yeah, screw it, I can do this. I'm a gamer. There were dragons. Were. Oh my god. Are, are you all out? No, they are not over here. There, there was a guy down here. Not anymore. We just spawn projectiles all of the time. Well, that's speeding up time and stage selection. Oh, cool. Alright, well. And I don't think we're going to get the gun upgrade, so we can probably just build something else out. We've got the eye. Uh, We've got the everything for it. Honestly, an Attractor would kind of be nice because there's so much XP we're just not picking up. Because I want to keep moving. Uh, 
really wants to give it candelabra. Oh, yeah, we'll go Santa Moisture, because the gun's not happening. The other gun just does not want to, uh... Orb. Where is Orb? Have I... There is an Orb! Oh, yes! Give me Orb! I want to attract... Yes. Yes. I do not care. Just give me the EXP. We'll make it work. We'll make it work, baby. I promise. Oh my god. I'm going to share my screen while I sit here, because it looks like Freya will be joining us. But yeah, good luck with the bitrate. Um, it's not going to get better, so uh, yeah, just, just enjoy as best you can. Cool, lightning hoop. Uh, you know, just give me XP. I, I don't care. Just, just give me XP. I want to level up. Close am I to the uh bot? I'm up. Alright. It's just bonus XP. Yeah. Or me! Thank you! Oh yeah, baby. Yeah. Orb. Orb. <laughs> all right, all right, guys. You can. You don't have to give me any orbs. At this point, I'll take other things. Increase the duration of weapon effects by 10%. I'm just gonna stand here. Uh, Freya, I'm in the streaming channel if you want a vibe. I'm really conflicted on whether or not I take level 9 Tarona's box. Because I know it's risky, but I'm melting everything. Let's, let's let's analyze this situation here. You're 20 minutes into the run. Uh huh. Oh god, I can hear myself lower. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Um, if you were to activate Torona's box at this point, you would probably kill your one. If it was earlier in the run, then like yeah, do it. But right now, it would be too risky to banish it. Then. Yeah. <laughs> All right. At this point, I'm just going to head north until I see Crab and being, you know, south of Crab, I guess. Uh, do I have anything that's going to upgrade? Yeah, sadly, I could not get the uh, op the uh, other piece of gun, and I don't have the ability to get Tiramisu. So I cannot upgrade guns, but I took one just because... I don't know, this man's projectile city. Oh yeah, Gennaro is big on projectiles. Nothing, nothing gets close to me. It, it's just the life I have to live. 
Oh, hey. Oh, you were purple, but I don't have another thing, so it couldn't give me an arcana. Yeah, no, I just got the arcana thing earlier. Nice. Um, also, a raid's not happening tonight because a couple people are having, like, connection issues. You, you probably... You're still in the server, so you could assume. But, yeah. Yeah. It is what it is. Yeah, the Northeast is getting kind of hammered by a hurricane, and even the stream quality is fluctuating all over the place. Oh, yeah, no. My <laughs> stream's been wacky tonight. I'll leave it at that. Yeah. It started off with some weird bumps that normally don't happen. Though, I thought we were a little bit, you know, more in the coast, so we don't see the effects of it all that much. We're still getting some weird oddities. But yeah, no, I, I just walk north and then wiggle left and right, and by the time anything gets close, it's dead, so it doesn't really matter. And I, I, I'm full of... Oh. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> so, like, yeah, just nothing gets to me. After being on the internet for so many goddamn years, nothing gets to me. <laughs> uh, the ending of this stage does get very rough, however. Yeah, no, I've yet to see past the crab. I did a nun run earlier, and that worked pretty well. Yeah, she tanky. Yeah, she got the crab, but the problem is the crab spawned south of her. South of her. Yeah. And that's a death sentence. Them big meaty claws. Big meaty claws. That's why I'm heading north. I'm just gonna make it easy. Also, I took a bit of a break from this game because my eyes are starting to hurt trying to get all the achievements day in, day out. I still have like another 30 achievements left. <laughs> I'm not gonna do all achievements. I'm just getting my fun out of it. That's it. Oh, money! Nah, don't worry. Eventually you'll get sucked in hard enough to where you're gonna be like, well, may as well do the rest. Yeah. <laughs> hey, there's chests down here. Big water. Big water. Are there many relics in the level after this one? I think so. Oh, I broke a thousand on that one. That was a good gold fever. Yeah. Alright, Manticores. I gotta start walking north once I get this chest. Though this chest is really more for posterity than anything else. Because everything's upgraded, at this point it's just... You know. Oh yeah, are you going for the coffin? Already got it. Nice. Somebody in chat helped me figure out where the mirror was. Oh yeah, because I was going to say the coffin is technically not on the map. You had to like, go into this other thing. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Spooky yeah. Bun. How was your stream? What were you streaming, Spooky Bun? Become fun governable. Ungovernable. I Amazing. Love it. Great tagline. <laughs> Wizard 101. Nice. Ah, wizard game that doesn't support an asshole. Yeah. Oh. Well, it finally gave me these options. I'm gonna manually pick it for now, because there's gonna be points in the near future where I'm gonna want the chicken. Yup. The superior wizard game. Hell yeah. Get your crab ass out of here! Speaking of wizard games, I miss Magicka. It was a broken ass game, but I miss it. Uh, Magicka was the game where a certain combination just crashed your computer, right? Yeah. Good.
Like, you would learn the one spell that was just like, okay, this just kills everything. I guess I'm going to use it over and over again. Until you got to the point where it didn't kill everything, and you're just like, okay, well, I guess I suffer now. <laughs> Much like this game. Yeah, and uh, you find the combo that works for you <laughs> until uh, it no longer works, then you find a new combo. <laughs> yep. Have you played Noitia? I've seen no, a lot of people play it. Oh, these big men can survive a little bit. That is until they get to the moisture zone. Once they hit the moisture zone, they're fucking dead. Ah, the cum puddles. Ah, the cuddles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, thank you for the follow, friend. Right. There are a lot of games that I want to play. There are a lot of good games out there, but it's also just like... Man, when City Skylines 2 drops, that's the only thing you're seeing on this channel. I hope you're, like... I'm gonna get like 30 viewers for like two weeks, and then it's gonna drop down to the 10 people that are always here. And that's exactly. gonna be, it's gonna be nothing but City's content. And then somebody big's gonna raid in, and it's gonna be like, wow, this person knows what they're doing. And then everyone's gonna know me for just City Skylines, and I'm gonna play something else, and no one's gonna watch. And that's the life of streaming. That is the streaming life cycle. Just gotta hope people like me for who I am. <laughs> people just like me for Waka. <laughs> I like you for a lot more than Waka. Hell, I don't even True. like Waka. I'm not a rhythm gamer. <laughs> I don't True. like Waka. Freya wants to know your location. <laughs> nah, I respect people who don't like actually want to play rhythm games. They're fucking hard. True. I like you for who you are. Oh, thank Aww. you, Martin. <laughs> thank you for being one of the ten. <laughs> one of the real ones. The real homies. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, like I understand people wanting to watch a certain bit of content as well. There are certainly streamers that if they're doing something other than a certain subset of games, then I don't really want to watch them. And that's, you know... Be there's There are a lot of streamers that when they play different games, their complete attitude changes. Like, when I play 14, I am much less outgoing, but that's because I'm usually with seven other people, and we're reading calls and whatnot, that, or, like, we're listening for calls and whatnot that need to be listened for, you know? Like, we can't yeah. be bullshitting around the whole time. As much as streamer me wants to do that, raid me does not want to, like, disrespect the others with that bullshit. Exactly. I'm just surprised that, like, I get a good, consistent viewer base for raid content. That was not the case last year. People people don't understand what's going on, but they enjoy watching it, which I'm, fi I'm fine with. I'm, I used to stream raiding, but I run too many tools. It would probably get me banned from 14 if I streamed it, which is why I don't stream raiding anymore. Nobody cares as long as it's, like, nothing cheaty. I used the extra lines on the floor plugin. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I, I still don't think a lot of people would care, but there are those sweats, yeah. Yeah. I look during other things, it doesn't matter what the streamer is, as long as it's a vibe. That's understandable. I mean, to be fair, City Skylines Me is a different vibe than most other games me, but that's because City Skylines Me is a different brain than normal other games me. Like, City Skylines, like, taps into my primal SimCity instincts and brings out that side of me that normally isn't out. That brings out, like, pieces of my IT day-to-day -day job brain. So, like, oh, shit. It, it taps into stuff that I enjoy, but I normally don't really get to express at work. Or express at, well, I guess at work and on stream. It's, it's efficiency, it's numbers, it's micro-adjustments to make things just perfect. It's all sorts of things like that. So you're saying that since I work in accounting, I should stream EVE Online. 
You know what? I know that Down the Rabbit Hole is making a six hour <laughs> EVE Online video just oh, recounting shit. some of the major conflicts. He, he, like, literally, Fred was on stream talking about it and was just like, yeah, no, if I went in depth on anything EVE Online, I would be making literally like 10 hour documentaries. Holy shit. These are cursory looks at the the big end at like the major combat, the major escalations. I will quit yeah, and get it. the extra cash. Ooh, three thousand dragon shrimps. Hyper Gallo Tower. Hurry mode. Oh, you unlocked the doggy. I unlocked Omni apparently, even though I banished the box, but whatever. No, Omni is a passive upgrade. Oh. Okay. Pull a so we, got, we got the fifth stage. Mm -hmm. Got a few new characters. Hyper mode on for four normal stages. Okay. Consetta. Oh. Uh, oh yeah. Game. Have you done Moon Glow yet? I don't think I've gotten it. Uh, I think you have it now. What is Concetta? Oh, yeah, the rock star. Concetta's really fun. <laughs> also, banger music. Like I have Concetta as uh, character specific music. I have Capella Manga, Ilm Boys, Moon Glow, which is a bonus. Yeah, you should do Moon Glow. What is Moon Glow? It's a bonus stage that has things. I don't want to spoil it, but it is very. Things happen. It's important. Just, it's just important. That, that's all you need to say, girl. It's important. <laughs> I right, got a couple ranks in Omni. We'll go Conceta. And I guess we'll go to Moon Glow. And there's this wiggly noodle guy. Uh, no hyper, no hurry. We'll just hit it normal. But we'll keep the Arcanas. Yeah, because I think hyper multiplies enemy oh. health in this one. Iron Blade will. Listed weapon projectiles gain three bounces and might pass through enemies and walls. Oh. I don't have anything that really benefits my current set, but I'll I'll do Divine Bloodline because I'm probably going to get water. Water is just always nice. Hello? Oh! Hello! Okay. Glass Vizard summons the merchant in all stages. Oh, yeah, okay. That unlocks him for everywhere. It's a good relic to have. So this is how you get, like, I guess, certain interesting things. Okay. Oh my god. So for this map, I wouldn't worry about rolling for accessories because you get one of every single default accessory on the map. So just get whatever weapons. Yeah. Okay. Just I don't, don't know. stack all your accessories at once because it makes them that much harder to level because you have a lot more things to level. Yeah, no, I think I'm going right for the um, southeast corner because it's cooldown, it's the projectile, it's um, the AoE, like it, it, the three good things and one thing I don't know, which, oh, is revival. Literally, like, I go southeast yeah. corner, it's just going to be good times. Oh, the map's not very big, by the way. You'll get there in, like, five seconds. It's oh, a very okay. small map. Oh, damn. All right. <laughs> yeah, you can see the stuff literally right there. <laughs> yes, the bathroom level. Absolutely. Look at all the linoleum. I mean, yeah. Let's just get some weapons. That's interesting, though. He summons just giant fuck you spikes. Yep, and they summon like as soon as you stop. It makes for interesting movement. Like it, it's a great weapon. I think it's the most creative weapon in the game, honestly. Yeah, that's very interesting. Yeah. Uh, what does like, it? What does it combo with? 
Uh, it <coughs> combos with the wings, I think. Oh, this movement speed one? Yeah. Let me let me make sure. Yeah, it combines with the wings. Well, that's unfortunate. I, I guess. Uh, AOEs, yeah, I guess. Oh, you don't unlock Revolt yet. No, <laughs> I've I've unlocked. I've got the ability to banish <laughs> earlier. Yeah. You have to get to eighty on a few of the unlock characters to unlock Revolts. Hmm. And also keep in mind this stage is only 15 minutes. It's oh. not a 30 minute stage. Yeah. So, uh, spoiler, it said so in the box you didn't read before starting the level. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Well, I want to get, like, yeah, the, the Tyrone, because, like, that's the one one of the passives I have not ever found. And I feel like that's, I guess, the way you get it is by finding it here. Uh, that's not how you unlock it. There's some character you have to level to unlock it. Tiramisu is, like, a pick item. Uh. Let me check who it was. I keep forgetting. Is it the, is it the Bayonetta? Because her weapons upgrade with it? It's, uh... Survive for 20 minutes as Crochi. He's like that red demon looking dude with the wings. Mm. And you get him by killing 100,000 enemies total in your game. I think I've gotten that before. I'm pretty sure I've I've got him. Yeah. We were forced to take the candelabra, so we might as well get the free level up on it here. What an interesting character, though. Yep. If you want if you want to really use that weapon real good you could like walk in a direction then like turn 90 degrees and stop ah yeah there's a there's a finesse to this weapon Interdusting. Crab. 
attack its weak point for massive damage. 599 US dollars. Ridge Racer! Ridge, Ridge Racer! Racer. <laughs> God. Oh <my> God. <laughs> that sucks that E3 is gone. We'll never get shit like that again. Or the yeah. horrible Ubisoft conference. Oh my, oh God. my God. Peggle 2. Peggle 2. And that's it. Man leaves. Man knows his <laughs> job's done. <laughs> Brought the only thing of worth to the EA conference. Yo. Well, I guess I'm getting something new. Um, give me the bibble. It's the bibble. The bibble. <laughs> but yeah, just hit me with Bibles. It's Bible time. Do you remember that old kids show Bible Man? Oh my God. <laughs> Fucking sending me back to the the unforsaken <laughs> era. Oh, back to the era of youth group. Ugh. I always oh, thought boy. Bible Man and Captain Underpants should fight. <laughs> be a hell of a totally should. Be a hell of a fucking fight. <laughs> uh. I don't know what I just did to kill everything, but I'll do it again. I'll do Probably it again. Ran. Probably ran to a rosary. Uh, yeah, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The temptation is to run into all of them. Also, oh, Neri came into the call and left. Oh. Wait, did Neri have like talk permissions in here? Uh, no, but I can give them talk permissions. Yeah. Neri! Yeah, now the, the reason this place doesn't have talk permissions open is because it gets dangerous. Where are they at? Where are they at? They disappeared. I don't see them anymore. Oh, they'll be back. Uh, I think they're in a pure offline, so I don't see them. Ooh. Yeah, I just need to give them speaker, but I can't. I need to see them before I can give them speaker. We'll put beans in a Twinkie. All right, near and give you roll speaker. And then if you leave and come back, you should be able to speak. Hello. I really, I really enjoyed the part where I came back to who put beans in a Twinkie. <laughs> Look, it's in my memes chat. <laughs> also, Abby, are you feeling better? Um, yeah, no. Overall, I'm feeling pretty spicy. I'm gonna tell work otherwise, but that's because boss, boss makes a lot. I don't make shit. Okay. Well, I'm just glad you're feeling better, honestly. That's why I come in the company spit. I don't know. Plus makes a dollar, I make a smidge, that's why I shit in the company fridge. There you go. There we go. Right, I forget, do you enter the gungeon? Uh, nope. Okay. She I'm is not a gun. Yes. Yeah. Final Fantasy XIV refuses to let me log in today for some reason. It's almost like there's critical weather conditions on the East Coast, and they're just kind yeah. of fucked. The East Coast is getting beast coasted on. Yeah, unless you're out here, it's actually sunny and beautiful today. It was a yeah, wonderful it's, day. It's, it's fine here. It's literally just, I think the server is up further north than here. All right, we're not 10 minutes in. That wasn't the 10 minute crab. The 10 minute crab? No. How juicy. What? 
Oh yeah, no, that's the, the crab that shows up at 10 minutes. That was only the 8 minute crab. The crab that shows up at 8 minutes. This crab kills you at eight, in 8 minutes. Stay away from it on vacation. Well, now it's all mermen. <laughs> Moomin? Um... What was that one Disney Channel original movie with the fucking teenager that was a merman? I forgot the name I of that movie. Forget. Oh my god, I know what you're talking about. Oh my god. You just unlocked a brain cell that I wish you hadn't. I remember it. It was... It was... It had a, it had a very interesting... Like, it, it, like his mom got ca ca caught by like a fisherman or something. And like the most of the movies just like involves this mermaid girl that he's trying to talk to. Oh, here oh. we go. The Thirteenth Year was the name of the movie. I assume right. it's because he's 13. Right, because when he turns 13, not only do your balls drop, but your fins grow. Your yep. scales, your scales <laughs> beshevel. Uh, that's where most of us became furries, or about that time, True. so yeah. Speak for yourself, I was fucking 17. Look, man, I was given a Sega Genesis and Sonic the Hedgehog. It was happening regardless of what I had to say about it. True, that's how I became a furry. It's a Sanix that did it for me, honestly. I was, I was actually reminiscing. Thank you for the amazing metal pipe noise that scared the fuck out of me. Anytime. Um, I was reminiscing in the car with my roommate, uh, en route to work today, and I'm, I just remembered, I'm like, my first PC game was Sonic CD. Ooh. Nice. I, I, I'm I, would the crabs. Always, I would always wonder, like, whenever I would go down to lunch, because there's not a dedicated pause button in that game, why the game was back in the menu. And it's because Sonic will just say, I'm out of here, and jump off the screen. Our Sin of Genesis will never take me. Oh, yeah, so, uh, Techie, I told Abby to play Moonglow for reasons. 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 Yes. You, know, you reasons. know those reasons. Oh, hey, that's a good weapon. Why do I have Diesel now? That's a busted <laughs> weapon. Vin Diesel will be like, why am I here? It's a very good weapon. Oh. I just fired, like, Sailor Moon. It's just a full screen now. Good job, Abby. You did it. Abby, I'm going to get you a game. I'm going to go on you. sale next. I'm, I'm also just going to get them. Abby, uh, I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get Abby into the gun. I'm going to get Abby into the gungeon. Uh, I probably won't play it. I'm going to be real. It's not... I don't know. I don't know what... Not really my Dungeon is a game you inflict on someone. Yeah, but I don't... Shobo inflicted it on me. I cast First Adventure of the Gungeon on you. I'm putting you in the Gungeon and you can't get out. I cast Super Hexagon on you. Stop. Fuck it, I'm just taking everything at this point. Detroit I just want to cause. Detroit become ungovernable. Oh, just normal Detroit. Yeah, sounds about right. Oh, that was satisfying. I think it's the worst evolution, not the worst weapon, but the worst evolution. Yeah. Is what it is. I'm still learning stuff, so. I don't know. Oh, you playing Evolution Slaps? Playing <laughs> Vampire? Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. Tomu's been Tomu has played that game a lot and wanted me to get into it. Fun. It's it's worse than opium in terms of addiction. It's worse than opium. Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, opium—the thing that you know, like ruined nations of people. Thanks, British. Yeah. Yep. Thanks, the British. <laughs> Thanks, the British. Thanks, the British. Oh, British. I I bought um Groove Coaster, Freya. Oh, hell yeah. Sad that the Jevil music isn't on that game. Yeah. I don't know what I'm uh, World here. Revolving is in the arcade version. I don't know if it's in any console versions. It's not. Damn. Yeah. Wow, this thing does a lot of damage. When the sus is mungus. Alright, I've got two evolutions, so I should be safe for a bit. Ooh, I found it. That's a lot of eyeballs! Me when I look at you. 
Abby, I'm looking at you. <laughs> Why won't you look at me? And then he looked at me. All those eyeballs, be not sus. <laughs> and then he looked at me. And then I got more Bibles! And I'm more- I'm sorry, why is Felix, uh, Colgrove released a video called The Lost Suburb 12 hours ago that is an hour long? Oh. Apparently they lost the suburbs. This is the guy that did Double Thing. Would you like a quick hint? It might be too oh, late for- Oh, I love that video. He just released a sure. video 12 hours ago called The Lost Suburbs that's an hour long. The Lost Sub. What is the, uh, what um. is the hint, Arcane Snacky? Which is a great name. No. Take Clover. Okay. You can just take everything. Take two of these and call me in the morning, see? No. The hint is stop touching eyeballs or you will die. I'm trying, but they keep touching me. Five Ds of dodgeball, dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge. I thought you were just saying five Ds like you, Gao. Five Ds. <laughs> like, finally, a conversation I can relate to. Never mind. Never she mind. She can dodge a wrench. She can dodge a ball. Ah oh, yeah, Skibbity Toilet 62 has been released. Oh boy, Skibbity Toilet. I hate that meme so much. Ah, oh, good. You're my... aware of the lore. No, I just hate it. One of my roommates, like I have to, I share, I share a bed with one of my roommates, and he leans over, puts his hand on my shoulder, like he's doing one of my con. What do you want? And he's like, Have you ever heard of the skibbity toilet meme? And I just blinked and rolled back over, and he started laughing. Skibbity toilet, get in the park. I've never been more mad at him in my life. <laughs> Andrew, if you leave and come back, you should be able to speak. <laughs> yeah, we had to update your permissions. Yeah. There we go. P How's does that? part two be like, yeah. What was that? Leave and come back? You got. Good thing is, I don't have those sounds enabled, so I can't hear you hit me. I think, I think, I think, I think, I think, it's, I think it's for the best. What are people. these eyes? That's a lot of eyes. Who are you? What is this? Why am I high? I don't know, man. I don't know, man. Have you considered, um. Have you considered getting your on? eyes checked? Uh, 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 that's some angel players. shit. Vividly accurate eyeballs? Vividly accurate angel. Did my vampire survivors? This is the Wait, the music stopped, the what? Word of the mighty Jimmy? Why did the music <laughs> stop? <laughs> what? Why I'm... indeed? I'm watching Aqua Teen Hunger Force again. What did you oh, do to me? Yeah. What did you I do to me? I Wouldn't you like to know, weather boy? So, you will all be pleased to know... What is I this?! I'm in a boss?! Did you throw me into a boss fight?! Maybe. I don't know. What the Maybe. fuck?! This is a biblically a accurate... Abby. What? That's a bad word, Abby. What the hell is this?! I would suggest you keep running. I'm doing my don't best! Stop. I have the funny Sailor Moon bow. Bee! Oh my god. Uh, the stage is weird? A little bit, yeah! I don't know, I'm- I'm- Welcome to Holy Hell? Th they made a holy version of Hell? Yeah. Yes. Oh. Holy crap. Holy crap, Lo, is oh, he really Remember that time I was in? in? Oh, thank you, chicken. Hey, Peter, remember that time I survived vampires? <laughs> <laughs> More eyes, great. Um, is there a map- I don't- I can't hit escape! Okay, never mind. You don't You're need one to leave. Go right. <laughs> Doing the best I can. I just want to know what's up ahead. Yeah. see. Oh, it's up ahead. More right. All right. Well, it's the good no thing stop. There's a lot of chicken. Oh, please, Jesus. There is no Jesus. Death. Hey. What? Oh. What? Who? Yes. Yellow <laughs> sign. You got Permanent the line? yellow sign. Oh it's no, yellow. Thou the hast detection seen the yellow sign. of thou hidden hast item. Seen the yellow why is sign. why is a frog clapping for me? Because thou hast what? seen the yellow, the yellow sign. sign. You've seen the yellow sign. Okay, now it's time to get the now it's time to call Hastur in here. What? <laughs> Abby has never Hastur, been more confused in their Hastur. entire life. 
The fuck? Alright, so to understand what the hell... Ha- understand what the yellow sign is, have you ever heard of the novel The King in Yellow? No. Yes. Okay, let's let's ask a better question. Have you ever heard of Old Man Henderson? No? Okay. Perfect. So the Perfect. yellow sign... With surviving vampires. Okay, so basically... Um, Hastor, the yellow sign is the calling card of one of the outer gods, old, old, one of the great old ones. The name is Hastor. Um, the the book, The King in Yellow, is a reference to a play of the same name. Right, right. I do know this. I do know this. Now it's starting to come together because this was part of the um, this was part of the campaign we did with um Dan, wasn't it? There yes. was some Eldrick shit. Right. So basically, um. What, so basically, what, every time somebody tries to put on the King in Yellow, halfway through Act 2, it invokes Hastur, everybody goes crazy, and a large portion of whatever city the play was performed in gets sucked away to Old Carcosa, which is uh, the place where the King in Yellow sleeps. Right, this was also in the Lovecraft um, horny visual novel that what? they made me play. I'll take what? your word for it. There's a made you play. Uh-huh. There, there play is that. a game on Twitch that is a Lovecraft visual novel where you can date Cthulhu, um, the 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 yellow, oh, the king the in yellow. Or, okay, yeah, look. yeah, yeah. That it was there. They were there as well. Yeah. Again, made you play. <laughs> oh, yeah. Twitch chat bought it for me. Uh huh. And spent Abby. the points. Uh huh. Again, made you play a horny game. Uh huh. We well, the king in yellow in it. Yeah. <laughs> now, now, for those of you who aren't in the know, um, Old Man Henderson is widely regarded as the only player character of Call of Cthulhu who has ever managed to beat that game. Huh. Uh, basically, he did so by killing Hastor. How do you... How do you kill an ancient one, though? Um, the first thing you do is you get really fucking high. Uh, the next thing you do is you have your player character go into a fugue state, write a 500-plus page backstory, some of it written in languages he doesn't understand, and then third, you proceed to take a massive shit all over your killer DM storyline and pretty much end up killing Hastor. And then you... Yeah. He blew him up in a hockey ring. It is huh. a story. It is it is like one of the greatest tabletop RPG stories ever told. I I played Baldur's Gate. Does that count? Yeah. Uh, no. No. Like like the story of Old Man Henderson is legendary. Yeah, I'm being sarcastic. Okay. Good. Yeah. Yeah, and so the thing with the yellow sign is it is a symbol where if anyone were to look at it, they would go mad. It inspired a lot of Lovecraft's works where if you look at something, you go mad. Yeah. Oh. It wasn't actually written by uh, Howard Phillips' racist Lovecraft. Um, however, it is, um, inspi- it is directly inspired by his work. Okay. Which which of these demons is the hottest? Uh, yeah. Oh my god, Abby, please. Tea, we're done with the tea in this chest. So well, now... Crochet will unlock you tiramisu as a pick up item. So... That's why I wanted to get him. Yeah. So uh-huh. that was that was Moonglow, I guess. Then, huh? This but damn, Moonglow. you did you did the holy forbidden in one shot. Nobody fucking does that. Look, well, I shit. you you remember that time where you made me play monkey ball and I fucking did yeah. shit first try that you were like, what the <laughs> fuck? Yep. That takes people hours. <laughs> exactly. I did the same thing with fighting the beating the lich and gungeon the other day. Nice. Uh, so now I guess I go through every stage and look for the hello uh, the hidden item. Hello Kitty, go find All Hello right, Kitty. So- but yeah, now that you have the yellow sign, a new set of items are available to you. And uh, these sets of items where if used properly, you can beat death. Huh. <laughs> okay. Uh. So does that mean every stage has them? Every stage has this set of items. Huh. And this is from, like, that time I saw you with the gold ring, the silver ring. Yep. Like, 
in particular, the yellow sign lets you see Metalio left, Metalio right, the gold ring, and the silver ring. Well, yeah, not every stage. Most stages, yeah. And then killing death is the win condition, then. Is an oh. a, well, the actual win condition? The actual win condition. It unlocks a nice character. But it's not the actual win. It's not the actual beat the game condition. Oh. Uh. Okay. Well, and there are a few arcanas that require you to reach minute 31 of a stage, and this is one of the ways to do it. Uh, okay. Goddamn, look at all that. So there's me left, right, up, and down. Yeah. Yep. Okay. So, so here's the thing. Don't rush to those items just yet, because... By each of those items is a very powerful guardian. They will absolutely booty blast you if you go there too early. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. It's also new stuff in Capella Magina. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Huh. So the yeah, Clock Lancet that, and then Laurel the... together. Yep. So I'm guessing that's the, the ring... And the left and right with yes. these two. Okay. Really in deduction, my dear Watson. Thanks. My dear <laughs> Watson. <laughs> no, but no, but yeah, the Grimoire makes it kind of obvious. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So at this point, then I just need a build that I can get those two things on and work with. And do anything. Have you ever. Why do you have a game called Furry Shades of Gay? Because someone bought it for me and gifted it to me, and uh, I accidentally hit yes. Bought it for you, huh? It was Tank. It was Tank Facts. You at Tank Why Facts, he will 100% will fess up to. I will Abby. look in my Gmail right now and show you. <laughs> furry <laughs> Shades <laughs> of Gay. I'm looking at it in my Gmail. Uh huh. Uh huh. Here comes. Here comes Steam. Oh, you received Steam a gift cry, copy. You received a gift copy from, from Tank Frax. <laughs> Didn't the gift come from inside the house? <laughs> Abby. <laughs> it was a goddamn gift, you motherfuckers. There's why zero playtime like, on it. Why haven't you reciprocated? Yeah, you were like, it's the end of the week, I'm a gift myself. Uh, from Tank? Abby. Tank is a real person, people have met him! has been Tank Facts all along. I will- Ab Denial Abby. ain't just a river in Egypt, you know that. Right? <laughs> <laughs> if I want furry- <laughs> If I want game. furry <laughs> porn games, I can find better than what's on Steam. Abby, you that's Don't you rude. think so low Abby, of that, me? Abby, that's very rude. <laughs> they, they worked hard to make 50 shades of furry shades of gay. You see, yeah. I met Tank Facts IRL. I still won't buy your story. Fuck you! I sat down and I ate ramen with the guy. <laughs> and I still don't buy your story. <laughs> I can uh, get Tank in this call. Hold up. Tank, where you at? <laughs> We're doing bullying you. So, so Can you join the call and explain of furry is shades is of gay? Uh, question mark. <laughs> don't say. Yeah, you, you might want to word that differently. <laughs> I'll see. I probably should get Holocure at some point, even though I barely know any like Corpo VTubers. He's okay. <laughs> yeah. The. Uh... Uh, love it. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking! <laughs> Someone get tag and weezy in here. Uh, we do a little trolling. Uh huh. A little. Little. A little. Honestly, honestly, Abby deserves it. <laughs> oh, okay. Hello. Hello. Can you explain Hello. to us why Abby bought a furry porn game? <laughs> uh, so I actually, um, I don't think I bought that one. I did buy a box <laughs> of Rush though. <laughs> The truth comes Wait, out no, but no, out. I look at the Steam, I look at the Gmail, and the icon was a tank you blasting off a rocket. <laughs> yeah, no, this is, I mean, this is your old icon, strange, right? There's such strange things in this world. Like Abby lying. Don't explained. you do this to me! <laughs> you should do it to them. Oh. I, I, I will find, I will find the receipts. I can see oh, it now. The receipts. 
deranged VTuber threatens viewer with their life. <laughs> I mean, honestly, at a certain point... No, no yeah, I, I, I totally did it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You're letting me burn! Let me grill! Russian, you haven't touched it! Try! <laughs> Wait, you still haven't played Hi-Fi Rush? I yeah. need to, but I don't have the motivation to, because... Abby... I don't, like, I don't like rhythm games. I don't like that game, and I like that. And, and, and that game is very good. Just play the goddamn. Oh, oh my yeah. god, sunlight traveling. Hang on a second. That doesn't mean like, you guys need to hang on. You guys are fine. Like, actually, oh. though. I should, I should. I, um, well, if. We'll, we'll. You know, probably the next free night I'll do it then. You're not doing anything right now, you fuck! I'm in the middle no, of the Vampire true. Survivors run! Well, that Vampire Survivor's run could totally end sometime soon. It just depends. I mean, thou hast seen the yellow sign. You certainly got nothing else better to do. What's the yellow sign? Yeah, other, other Hi Fi Rush's buy, icon on my desktop? Other than buying uh, furry games, you know? Yeah, furry porn games. Yeah, you gotta have them. <sighs> Like you got the yellow sign, you reach you reach the very tippy end of the universe, and what do you see? You see 808's adorable little eyes looking back at you. Yeah. The, the internet has done terrible things to that cat. <laughs> the internet does terrible things to every cat. <laughs> every cat. Oh, Abby! The mom cat that um we uh, rescued Jiffy from because she stopped hanging out with her uh, has had three more kittens and she is hanging out outside. Aww. I have named one of them Fudge because they look like they have they smeared fudge on their face. Oh. Mm. Look, I learned. I've did since. Something meaner, but I'm glad you didn't. Yeah. I have I since learned that you can deny games on Steam. Oh, I learned that because of Super Hexagon. People kept denying me gifting them at Super Hexagon. <laughs> Why? <laughs> They're cowards. I learned that because of Dan and and Bad Rats. Dear God! Bad rats. Bad rats. 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 I like how yeah, the rats. I like how bad rats sold so many copies because of people sending it to each other as a bit that they had enough money to make a sequel. I bad hope. I hope it was built in Unity. <laughs> <laughs> what a what a curse! What a curse to put on a game company. I hope your product make, was built in Unity. <laughs> God damn. God damn. <laughs> that is kind of evil, I will admit. Incredibly evil. I curse you with Game Engine Unity. Oh, oh yeah, No Straight Roads is extremely good. I love that game. Like, it's, it's fucking awesome. <laughs> no Straits is great. <laughs> I no Straits. Oh, does that mean I'm not allowed? You can do whatever you want, gamer. No straight oh, days. Oh, I'm sad. I almost flawlessed it. Sorry, I'm full of man and meat. Um, you're, I'm sorry, you're what? I'm a big meaty man. Man meat? I thought you were an Abra. I don't know what you're Man about. thing. I have root beer. Trying to Mark. get the Rift Breaker for Factory Nuts, but Steam won't get me. Oh. Yeah, no, the problem is Factory Nights are kind of in a weird limbo right now. Because the server went down because we can't, like, somebody, somebody hard crashed it and I can't get it to boot up anymore. And I asked, you know, if anybody wants to take a look, try to bring the server back online. But the other thing is, like, I'm kind of out of it when it comes to, after, after that mod pack, I'm very much out of it when it comes to, the factory game, and I kind of want to take a factory game hiatus for a little bit. No problem. I'll get my factory gamer like sense Mojo. back. Yeah. Mojo, jo, jo. Ah. And when you do, we'll be here for you. Oh. I think satisfactory should be next, but we'll just wait until you're ready. The satisfactory will be fun. All right, fun fact, who knows who Liquid Snake's voice actor is? David uh, Hater? David Hater. No. No, Liquid Snake. Um, oh. Shit. 
Starts with a C. Caillou. Yes, clearly it's Caillou. <laughs> <laughs> that bald bastard! I knew he was up to something. That bald motherfucker. I knew that fucking clip of him saying, oh yes, daddy, in the meme format was so fucking familiar. That's Cam Clark! It's Cam Clark, that's who plays, that, that's who voices Liquid's name. Uh, he is a boss, he's voices a boss in Gungeon. Oh. I just found nice. this out yesterday. I need the clock no, lancet. No no How you just picked up the vacuum and sucked up every crystal meth on the map? I know, that's what I'm waiting for though, is for one yeah. of them to generate a clock lancet <laughs> for me. No, I didn't get any. So how's your rig group going, Freya? We're towards the end of phase four of top now. Oh shit, let's go! Yeah. Yo, Top is really putting me through the ringer and playing Reaper in like the most unconventional way imaginable. Like the optimization for Top is like so fucking nutty. I got I got Reaper Vis. Top optimization. Uh, I got Reaper Vis last week. Nice. Did you clear a? Uh, I forget. You cleared um the heaven sort of. Yeah. Okay, I couldn't remember. It's been a way too fucking long since I talked to you. You don't talk to me anymore! <laughs> you don't talk to anybody, to be fair. <laughs> she talks to me. Alright, Freya, we're gonna have some issues. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I met you at a convention, you should talk to me more. Clearly, that is my stipulation. True. It was very pog meeting you. I, if I had known you were actually going ahead of time, I would have, uh... Put more time aside to hang out, but bumping into you and and tattoo every three seconds in the <laughs> arcade and doing something with Pog. Yeah. Tahu can never stop playing piano keys. <laughs> that sounds like Tahu. I had the record of piano tiles for like five seconds and then Tahu suck it. Yeah, because Tahu's a fucking meth head. <laughs> there it is, Lancet. All right. At this point, we're gaming on the meth. But Kineticon needs to get its shit back together. Oh, yeah, I don't did know it ever it. though? I'm gonna be honest though, I'm really glad I went to FWA this year because the, the one prior to the, before that was so bad. I'm oh, a bit scared because MFF is gonna be a lottery for hotel and I'm just like, oh, oh yeah, I heard that. Good luck. Not only a lottery, but a lottery held two months before the convention. Ugh. Ugh. That's icky. Can you not yeah. just get hotel rooms at another hotel? I mean, you near could... the convention center for like a bajillion dollars. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Not if you get them early. No, they're still really? gonna be really expensive, TBH. Yeah, but if you get them like a year in advance. Oh well, that also That's comes just to do with plane tickets. Like, buy if you're going somewhere, buy a plane ticket like almost a year in advance. It'll be dirt cheap. Because who can predict it? Honestly, you know? true. Doctor Strange. And as long as you've got um, insurance on it, then even if something... Well, if something goes wrong that's outside of your control, then they have to, you know... Yeah. Abby, the next time I visit, we need to we need to make me play a Zelda game. Because uh, I've played very few. Um, I mean, honestly, Breath and Tears are very good non-Zelda Zelda games. See, I'm gonna be honest with you about something. Uh, it's about uh, it's about Choose the Kingdom, actually. Uh, I liked Breath of the Wild more. That's fine. Oh, that's fair. And yeah, Cass was in it. Uh, exactly. That's fine. That, yeah. that for one. Um, the other one being, uh, how do I say this? Breath of the Wild was better to me because it implemented a bunch of new systems that I have never played in any game before. Uh, it's a new world, it's a new exploratory thing, and while Tears of the Kingdom had the above ground and below ground system, it just didn't have the same magic as it is, as the first game did. Okay. Also, I think constructing is very tedious. That's fair. Perfectly valid. Yep. And then I, after, I found out that after, uh, I, I, I said that to somebody, it's like, uh, Chuka Conroy said something similar and I rolled my eyes. Mm -hmm. Emil is a goober. <laughs> a very big goober. 
God, last time I heard that name, I was in middle school. Hi, yes. That was my, that was my, I, hi, I watched this person in middle school. Yes. Yo, look at that big man, Tiss. Big man. Big man has the rock. Still can't believe Abby went out of her way to just get a furry game like that. Wait, what? I can't, God I damn. Can't, I can't believe Abby would get a furry game like that either. Mm. I... <coughs> the worst part is the denial. I hear that. I love first. and respect yeah. my friends. That's so nice. Because Andrew. they love and respect me. And, and as Andrew says, denial is not just a room for any tips. I love that. I don't know why. <laughs> 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 That's okay, Abby. You don't have to reason to love your friends. <laughs> I think some of my friends are assholes. Be your asshole, sir. <laughs> How many assholes have you got on this damn thing? I'm surrounded by assholes. Keep firing, assholes! <laughs> I haven't heard keep firing assholes in a long time. Yeah. I remember when I first heard that shit. It was John Tron. <laughs> oh man, you got introduced. Not, no, no, not John Tron, Proton Tron. Why do I keep getting those fuckers mixed up? I like one, I hate the other. Okay, because if if you were gonna tell me that your first introduction to the absolute glory that is Mel Brooks was through John Tron of all people, oh, I would have been so upset. <laughs> Proton Tron is the better John. Exactly. I've never yeah. watched Proton John, so I couldn't tell you. He's a very funny individual. I'll take your word for He's it. He's very cool. And also very, yeah, like, is. kind and chill. Oh. Yeah. I actually found out uh, not too recently that Emil and uh, Tim are living together. I don't think they're dating, but I know they're living together. Well, yeah, that's because uh, last TRG they couldn't attend because they both got... Yeah. Yeah. COVID moment. Yeah, that disease is still a thing. It Stop is. forgetting it is. Three of the schools, what? three of the three of the schools near here are already closed because of it. Oh, by the way, CVS has boosters open now, so you should like get one. Well, not yeah. only not only does it have boosters, but this week, guess what got approved? Yeah, that's the what I mean. Boosters. That's why CVS. That's what I mean. Like CVS is, has a the the new boost the new booster, the yeah. good shit. Yeah. Yeah, they opened up the appointments now. I could get appointments for starting next week. I love video games. Also, I'm glad I could just like listen to a CVS and get it now. Cause my first vaccine, the, the, the big one, I had to go to the fucking Javits Center. It felt like what? the apocalypse actually. <laughs> yeah, I, I had to do, so I remember very specifically for my vaccination, um, I had to go to a, like, it was like a 24-hour vaxathon, and I had to, like, keep refreshing the page before I could get an appointment at, like, 5.30 in the morning on a Friday. Wow. So, like, Ugh. when I when I got my vaccine at the Javits Center, you could hear, on like, an echoing PA system, like, please remain in an orderly fashion. Like, it literally felt like a zombie movie. No, you know what it, you know what it was like. It was like the division. Yeah, there you go. It was exactly like the division. It was it was the Madison Square Garden mission of the division. Jesus yep. I still I still remember that the specifically the soundtrack for that mission. Oh, so good. I because the friend for the division, I was like, "Whoa, he used to work around there." Yeah. Is that Tom? The, the New York map's actually really good. It's like almost, or it's like exactly one to one, or as close as you can get to it within like almost the entire. It's like, it's like, it's like downtown slightly, and then a bit more of that, but like, it's, it's really, it's really good for, yeah. for what it is. I like how that's just also a thing in Spider Man games now. It's just. Look, when you make a Spider-Man game, you do a faithful recreation of New York. That's just the rule. It's the rule. It's the rule. It's yeah, the rule. Spider-Man's a mascot of New York. Yeah. Pretty much. 
Dude, Spider Man was how many, made in New How York. many Spider Man can you find in Times Square? It's like Spider Man game in. There's another one. But they, there's another one. What's something's going on here? Oh, it's like how every old timey game in Europe has to have the Eiffel Tower somewhere. Yep. Old timey? I'm gonna say. The Eiffel Tower's not that old. Yeah, Yo, really this nice. man's got a silver ring on his head. I'm gonna kick his ass. Yeah, I gotta say, those, uh, those <coughs> buskers in Times Square, they are predatory. Well, yeah, because oh, yeah, yeah. if you take a photo with them, like, they'll, they'll, they will nonstop harass you. Just like Done. the guy who hands you his mixtape and then says, oh, wait, you were supposed to pay for that. First time you I ever went into... To you. I don't First that. time I ever went into New York City, I was like, I don't know, 15 or 16. I didn't really have a great idea of, like, buskers and what they will do. So, like, this one lady was like, hey, I'm just trying to find donations for blah da 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 so I was like, okay, fine, sure, whatever. I hand her like a five or something like that. And then she like literally reaches into my wallet, grabs like 40 bucks. Oh yeah. And then writes on the paper, 45. Yeah. And then, yeah. Yeah. And I, I was just sitting there like, what in the hell mm -hmm. is going on? That's why you this <laughs> happening. Yeah, I was like 15. It was my first time in the city. I didn't know. <laughs> yeah, yeah no. that's that's why that's they go fair. for you. Is you that's were how they get you. Yeah, you were. You were susceptible. I was a mark. Honestly. <laughs> See, I I spent seven years working in and out in and around Manhattan. I perfected the glaze eyes glazed over. Don't bother me. I'm a New Yorker. Oh, uh, so the eternal peace blessings are actually pretty benevolent. Nothing shady ever happened to those. Those are literally just monks walking around giving them yeah. out. Or people those are fine. assuming they're monks. Yeah. Yeah. Bye. Worst you get out of it is a dumb trinket. It's a dumb trinket, and then they ask you for five bucks. You know they don't. They're yeah. Not risky, but you know, again, you just kind of, you just kind of got to develop the, the you don't, <laughs> don't bother me look. The I lost yeah. my soul years ago, don't ask me for anything. Absolutely. You need a thousand yard stare. Whew, yep. whew. Let me tell you something. I have heard every sob story on the, on the train. I have I have seen sh literal shit on the train. Like, I, I don't know if I can even tell that story right now. It's around. like no it's like no, you're not actually collecting for train fare for the next train out of here. No, <laughs> no you're not. <laughs> I actually remember a news story that somebody was doing where it's like they tailed one of these buskers and they like ended up at an apartment on the Upper West Side and like they jumped out of their car and just like, excuse me, you were just uh, busking for money on the train. How are you coming to this apartment? And then they got like the fucking thousand yard stare going right there. Yep. Yep. It's like, oh, not so busking now, huh? The problem is mm -hmm. that busking. one Mm -hmm. looking for assistance, there are five people who are just looking to get some tax free money. Yep. Yeah, but one rotten egg spoils the lot. Mm -hmm. uh, I can actually say there is only, as far as I am aware, there is one exception to the don't give money to buskers rule, and that's the mariachi band on the on 7 train. You absolutely tip them. Like, I'm, I'm actually genuinely serious. It is a full, like, three-man mariachi band. <laughs> Two guys got guitars. One guy's got an accordion. Like, they are full-on legit. Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. so. Also, like, if a hobo helps you out with something, I'll tend to tip them or something. They're like, oh, can I, can I like, roll your bag for you? And I'm like, sure. And then we get there, and then I tip them. <laughs> yeah, that's that's fine. Yeah. It's goods and surfaces. They have provided a service. You are repaying them for that service. That is entirely fair. I don't care what you say. I don't care who you're with. The first time you try and jump a turnstile, that's going to be the time you get busted. Mm-hmm. Yep. First time, every time. Yeah. Like, one time, like, after a rave, I was hanging out with a bunch of people, and one of them decided to get the bright idea to just hop the turnstile at the subway station we were at. Right around that corner, waiting was a cop. Yep. Oh. 
<laughs> just like that'll do it. Mm -hmm. That'll do it. <laughs> time every time. But you, you never jump the turnstile. What you do is you get your friend to open the gate and you run through the gate because they can't get you for that because you were the one that opened the gate. But never jump the turnstile. No. But, but the gate trick, I've done a lot of times. I can imagine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, I'm playing Outer Wilds. Uh-huh. Ooh. Good Outer game, Wilds. good game. I don't like fish. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like them. Why? <laughs> I don't like them. No, sir, I don't like them. I don't need to. I don't need to justify myself. I'm a fan of Outer Wilds. I'm telling you, jack shit. Well, I've played through the story of Outer Wilds. Well, not the DLC spoil. though. Oh yeah, no, I'm yeah, not. There could be people watching who haven't been Outer Wilds yet. Absolutely. And they better. <laughs> they better. It's one of those games I can't say shit about because every little detail is a spoiler, which means you should play it. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a really good game. Still fucking hate fish, though. <laughs> yeah, nothing wrong with that. I'm not a fan of them myself. Fishes are bitches. You know who else hate? Well, nah, didn't actually hate fish, but uh, 2B likes fish. Once. <laughs> Once. <laughs> One time. One time? One, One fucking time. time. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, let's see if I can kill this pen. Time to shoot myself in the head. Please do not actually shoot yourself in the head. I'm playing Enter the Gungeon! Ah, uh, you're doing that bit of the Gungeon. Yeah. You mean, you mean the gameplay of the Gungeon? The gun that shoots. Oh, great. Wonderful. Excellent. Alright, so I'm going to pick up three luck items. <laughs> I wish I could mark the map. Uh, that'd be too easy. Uh, there's an option where you could see items as like a compass. Oh. If you go to show guides under the map. Ah, cool. And then, and then it kind of gives you like a compass thing that shows where the map items are. That is really nice. Oh god. So, uh, Abby. Yeah? How's your, uh, how's your Vampire Survivors run? Um, pretty healthy. We've <laughs> not really had many issues. Nice. Cool. Why do you ask? Because you haven't played your furry porn. I mean, yeah, Hi-Fi Rush? <laughs> uh, <laughs> either or. Uh, to be honest, the porn's yeah, not in that game. <laughs> not in that go, one. You have to go elsewhere for that porn. Uh-huh. Don't worry, next time I'll just send furry feet. No! <laughs> <laughs> Jaw had to play that on stream because he met a sub goal. Why? <laughs> his, his, his AI TTS was so fucking ridiculous, man. Oh god. Also, yeah, you may want to get a move on for these items because to get the evolutions that require all of them, all the items have to be max level. Ah. Uh, Not just a base item. I these. did it. I'm going straight for the ring then. Yeah. And you have about nine minutes to get however many levels it takes to max those out. Which I think is doable. We just have to be quick about it. Yep, yeah, I'm heading down that way. I'll just grab luck really quick. Because luck will help in the long run. Hey, you're full of chest meat. Give me. God, I wish it was the fiver. No, not Nekopara! 
Wait, no, you they're wrong. Want... It's not Sora too. This is here, Abby. Okay. I mean, are we are we trying to say that Abby wouldn't play Neko Park? No. Yeah, you're right. No, you totally play it. Would no! Play Nekofara. <laughs> okay, so Tank, am I the one gifting Nekofara this year, or is it you? This year? This year. Um, this year it should probably be. Uh, I can deny me. gifts, you know. Why would you want to do that? Why would you want to hurt our feelings, Abby? Yeah, because it turns out accepting generous. any gifts from anyone leads to Abby's people questioning air. things in your Steam library. You're Abby's emotionally vulnerable. You can, say, you can show them your purchase history and say, look, I received it as a gift. Oh. Exactly. Wow, I wonder what happened last time I do that. <laughs> hmm. I wonder, people totally believed you that time. Uh-huh. As my oh, close dear like friends issue. immediately believed me. It just sounds like a skill issue. It sounds, to me like the, sounds to me like the Fizz range just talking. Yeah. We're not gaslighting you, what's that? There might be something wrong with your brain. I don't know, it's, uh, I don't pay your sub, so, you know. <laughs> I mean, if you're subscribed to him, then you probably do. Or... I mean, te hey. technically... Te technically speaking, Abby does come and pay my sub. <laughs> I pay you as an editor. Yeah, as an editor, which then goes back into your stuff. <laughs> but you know, I, I do that willingly. I don't have to. Mm -hmm. Also, Abby, in my defense, unless you changed your uh, stream thing recently, your information does say any pronouns. Does it? I thought yes. I, put, I thought I swapped it back to she/her, yeah. or I swapped it to she/her. Huh. Like I said. Unless it's been recent, I think it still says that. Let me see. Twitch.tv slash Abra. Uh, da, 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 da. Ah! Pronouns. Sure oh, yeah, stinky? no. Pronouns says you would have uh, use whatever, but. Oh, wait, what's this? You may use whichever pronouns you like, so long as they are black. Don't know what that reference is. You can use is. any pronouns you like, uh, as long as she, her, holds a knife. Uh, uh, it's Henry Ford. You can have a Model T in whatever color you like, so long as it's black. Uh, sorry, I'm not privy to the those kids and their Henry Ford Model T references yeah she's a lost cause get her get her skibbity toilet and the model t you know what abby i think it's about time i cancel that sub <laughs> what to who to you. to you why for the skibbity toilet i assume yeah that's that's it that's the one Wait, what honest, is? I, I, I why did you give me Italian plus point oh two? You're you're debuff. <laughs> you're Italian now. It gave me an Italian buff. Debuff. You're Italian now. <laughs> debuff. <laughs> Italian. It's like the it's like the people that play um uh uh Dead by Daylight hex Italian. This is a gun. I'm not sure if it's a good gun, is the thing. Me and Did my six rivals. His head? I'm so confused. Me and my bibbles. Me and my bibbles. You dare off question to go. the word of the mighty Jimmy? Jimmy! I the funny thing is I, I was too young for those shows. They they were off the air by the time I was anywhere near the age to watch which, them. Which is crazy because they kept got giving Aqua Teen more fucking seasons. Seasons, yeah. That's it, the weirdest part. 
And I still don't watch them. <laughs> Man. It's, it's good. I love Aqua Team. There, there was an advent to shit like uh, C-Lab and Brack Show. It was... It was... And Harvey Birdman. Harvey Birdman Attorney at Lost. Before so they lost show. the ability to use all the Hanna-Barbera shit. And they oh had to make, God. like... Man. Okay, make... Harvey Birdman was delightful. Yeah. I still, I still have the the scene imprinted in my brain where it's like, we come from the <laughs> far off distant year of two thousand and two, and he looks at the desk and the calendar says two thousand and four. Fuck. <laughs> oh my god, that show is so good. <laughs> what what happened? Uh, Hanna Barbera got a stick up their ass? I mean, they kind of had to towards the end. Yeah. I mean, it, it's it's one of those things where it's like they were around, they were the direct competitors to Disney, you know? So they've got to kind of stand their ground at a certain point. And their newer, um, their newer uh, lawyers have been way stricter than the previous ones like oh yeah no williams williams street had free reign to do a lot of shit that they should not have been able to do yeah. don't use my name in vain no they weren't talking about you just your street fires one singular b just one Egg. Just the one. What's the egg? It's a piss beam. A piss beam. Yeah, I have that weapon. It's in a you different game. You know, there's actually there's this other game that has a beam weapon in it. Yeah, it's called Enter the Gungeon. No. That wasn't that wasn't necessarily the one I was referring to. There are several piss weapons. God, I need multiple of those multi-level ups. I thought you were about to tell me you need multiple piss, piss, level, piss weapons. <sighs> I don't think I'm going to get the chest to get the upgrades I need. Unfortunate. Death Damn. comes for us all. Abby <laughs> has an insufficient chest. I'm Don't taking pills out. for that. Yeah, true. Whatever you need to say to validate yourself, sweetheart. Oh! It's testosterone! Know, or, not testosterone, but estrogen! I hope you're not taking testosterone for that, honey. <laughs> testosterone. Abby. Abby. What's so wrong? Fuck you! Abby. Abby. You're some kinds of testosterone. Testosterone. I hope they can see me, because I'm doing this as hard as I can. I'm giving it all she's got, Captain. I got a very weird synergy in Gungeon the other day. That was just <laughs> yes, it is testosterone. That was that was um testosterone. That it was the quad laser, and um moon scraper. And so whenever I fire the quad laser, it just has a bunch of beams coming out of it. I still love that stupid fake HRT gummy ad. Oh God, that's tough. It's like. <laughs> When dis when dysphoria ain't for ya. What? <laughs> when dysphoria ain't for ya. What? This person said that they woke up um, in a fever dream and like crawled out of bed and opened up Blender and made an entire advertisement um, based off of like a fake uh, HRT ad. Uh. And uh, I got the Magnetos left and right, but unfortunately I need a chest to actually upgrade it, and I don't see one. I have one you can borrow. Borrow. Bro, walk through the little clock lancet. You son of a bitch. You son of a bitch! No, no, if you're clever enough, you can freeze him for a while. 
You just have to be very good at what you do. <laughs> what is it that you do? Ah! I'm on fire! Oh my... Can you do it? And you dig it! <laughs> what the fuck is this? Sounds like hell on earth. Well, if you're gonna get that chest, you better get it quickly, because at minute 31, if you haven't killed that death, a second death will spawn. There's no way I'm getting there, it is so far away. Well, if you can at least make it to minute 31, then you can get an Arcana. Yeah, no, I'll make it to minute 31, because I keep lanceting the man. Yep, there's 31. Yeah, nah, I, I double down! <laughs> I don't know if this is gonna do a lot of damage, but we're gonna find out if it's gonna do Look, a lot. Look, you fuckers! Look, you fuckers! <laughs> you just be like, Death will not stop me! <laughs> Look, you fuckers! Stop Death poking me! Death might not stop you, but being accused of downloading furry stuff will. <laughs> right in your tracks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, there's this, actually, there's this really cool uh, furry character in uh, Hi-Fi Rush called 808. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. that character in, in, uh, so, so when do I yeah. get, like, a death that's bigger than these deaths? Ah, uh, see, avoiding the subject. I will get what, to high five. There mean? it goes. What do, you mean? Uh, what do you mean, big deaths? Are, are you talking about little deaths? Got another revive. I don't know what she's on about. I've got another revive! I found the secret room. I keep finding pie! Okay. At that point, it sent. I don't know how many goddamn deaths after me. Quite Enough, a few apparently. deaths. Enough, apparently. Yeah. All right. So you got Mad Groove, which is a very good card, and here's why: it attracts every item on the map towards you, including stage items, including the yes, you can beat death items. Okay. I'm gonna go for now. Thank you for letting me vibe. Whatever. No problem. We are starting Hi-Fi Rush. Okay. Oh, yes. No, not high on life. Oh, God, that game. The game that huffs its own farts. Oh. <laughs> starting Hi-Fi Rush for the first time at stream notifications. Starting hi Wi-Fi rush for the first Wi-Fi rush. Wi-Fi rush. <laughs> Lo-fi rush. Can you see this mark? The game is auto-saving. Do I want to do this with controller or with uh controller? Okay. Controller. Okay. controller. Okay. Next language English. Yeah, yeah, English, English, English. Continue with English. Uh gamma slider. Should be fine. Near where it is. Yeah, continue with these settings you wanna read. Oh god, the game starts in borderless window. It's already got good marks. Streamer mode on. Cutscene oh, subtitles turn, on. Turn it on. Turn yeah. it on. Keep it on. Why? We never got hit by copyright yet. Because nine inch nails are, and um That's a big that, That's a big name. I I'm not gonna I'm not gonna play around with like actual yeah, actual record labels here. Yeah, they will actually care. Uh, the first song that you hear in non-streamer mode is by the Black Keys. So, oh, you know, you know, great to play the 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 soundtrack version when you're alone. Um, but as you might see and might actually grow to like the fact that the absolutely none of the replacement like like streamer friendly tracks are at all bad like like they're all almost better in the context because it's like well we didn't even need you know to have the licensed tracks to have this be absolutely fucking amazing nice. i'm gonna do normal 
Yeah, and do, we'll, do, do normal. we'll adjust from there, because I'm assuming I can adjust difficulty midway if... Yes, you can. Okay. Like a good game. Mm hmm Now, but yeah, there has been endless philosophical debate on whether the licensed tracks are better than the non-licensed ones. Oh. I said next. Huh? Robot is very pushy. Chai. I'm gonna go watch this. Yep. Chai. The streamer, the streamer, I like, know a chai. Wait a minute. Star. Sorry. Future rock star. Anyway, what were you saying? Thanks. Oh, the streamer like started playing High Five Rush. I'm gonna go watch her. Oh, okay. Have fun. Are you done? Yeah. Uh, All right. Bye. Bye bye. Uh, whatever. Here's your project Armstrong Pass, and welcome to Vandalay Campus. Yes. I got the D rank. I should probably like stream this to the Discord or something. Then probably like work good mm -hmm. mm. all right cool alt tabbing didn't break it all right wow this game came out a while ago i wonder who gave it to me welcome applicant to project armstrong technology perfectly fused with a human body Together, we create better lives. And now, the CEO of Vandalay Technology, Kale Vandalay! Sorry, I'm gonna push that down. That's fine. I'm probably gonna hop out of call, too. Day. You're See the you. best oh, of the best. Later. And about to be even better. Thanks to our robot in Is this animation? Vandalay like, 2D animation? Or is this just really good 3D? You all in Project Armstrong are about to show the I think world this is 2D. just how special you can become. Now go, get ready for a better life. Cat. Uh, I'm with him. Special pass here. Uh, I think they just called my name. <laughs> Rippy dippy. Man broke his arm and instead of giving him health care, they decided, you know what, just rip it off. He doesn't need it anymore. Uh huh. Promised me the best of the best, Mimosa. Production asked for test subjects, Kale. Marketing. Delivered. Don't pin it on Ricka. Tell that grandstander Zanzo in R and D. We need people with influence, and you're giving me losers. It ah, works. the man listens it's to better. music. No what a loser. And no defense. What a piece of junk. <laughs> it's not broken. Oh, okay. That. I thought it, it looked. I thought he just had a broken arm. Then again, this is like the evil future, so they could just not give him proper, you know, medical care. An MP3 player in that day and age. Look, some people really love retro attack. Ah, that's unfortunate. Well, I've just become Iron Man. I will die. Alright, hello 3D. My pot has a heart. Yeah, you know, that's how Iron Man works. That's why he always comes into Guns N' Roses, right? And I'm fucking dead. I can see his underwear. Die. An error has occurred. Please proceed to the checkpoint. Okay. Okay, checkpoint. Where's that? 
Ah, eh, don't worry. Probably no big deal. Man, it's got hops. Oh. <coughs> no booster or dash or anything like that. He just goes. Hello. Oh, he has talked to you. My cleaning has your jumping, however, was impressive. Damn right! I got a vertical leap like no one's business. Mm, free energy drinks just lying on the floor. Right next to the cleaning robots. Why does this one say Lysol? Well. <laughs> Bros literally scout TF2. Yeah, time to get out of these clothes. Alright, cool. When do we play the game naked? Dude, take the three seconds and fix your shoe. You're gonna destroy the heel like that. I've done it to many a shoe. Hey! Hey, kid. Damn, they got hips. They got hips like Mewtwo. Wait, magnetic waste management? For an object morning. Looks like a defect. Take him in. Oh, I have a stick. Is that a weapon? Uh, I don't think Your so. type is showing. Think Damn right. Resisting. Wait, what? Cool, I died. Hit the button. Your cleaning robots do a shit job. Guess that's why I'm here. Pretty simple. Bad timing, though. Okay. What is going on? You didn't take a look at your chest when you changed out of the. Okay, bro. I look at my chest every time I take off my shirt. You don't? If I'm getting this right, first. Music player in my chest. I'm pretty sure that's not supposed to be there. Second, it's powering up my new robot arm. Third, it's making everything sync up with the beat. And this sounds ridiculous. But when the music kicks in, it feels like, like, like I'm on a stage. <gasps> <gasps> I want to kick ass, and magnetic guitar is too slow. Oh! They sell these at the store north of the city. Oh, there's a hole in them. Ready for something wild? Whoa. Chai's here, and his attacks sync up with the music. You all want to see it in action? Let's start with a light attack. A one-beat attack that quickly connects combos. Go ahead, try it out. Now try a combo and beat to the music. This will be what perfect timing feels like. I don't got great timing. Look at you. Perfect timing. <laughs> what, Tank? <laughs> oh, yeah. Your attacks always land on the beat, but press the attack button exactly on the beat to give bonuses in battle. Looks like you're ready for more. Head on over. They just need to put the, make, make the make the FES higher. That's all. They're dead. How about delivering 
some real damage. Oh, the and jump to the beat. Attack. This one takes two beats to land, so listen carefully for the beat in the middle. I got this. All right. Now try out a heavy combo in rhythm. This is the kind of timing to aim for. I wonder if I need to do a little calibration. Are you guys standing on your friend's corpses? Is this the guy? Okay, so I'm hitting on like the off beats and whatnot. I need to be better at that. I'm like one and two and three and it's not right. Not at all. Roll gauge moves to the beat. Four. So we're going to run into them. for stuff to explore now that I'm in the game proper, I feel. Yo. Hello there. Can I be of assistance? Sure. Uh, what are you? Bandelay Smartbridge VASF07. But commonly known as Smidge. Not very catchy, but hey, no indulging. Would you like me to explain your malfunctioning abilities? So it seems your problem may be attacking enemies to the beat. I wouldn't say it's a problem. Attacking enemies on the beat does more damage, so I sense it is beneficial for you to do so. For some people, the beat is hard to find. But yeah, no, I'm skipping the dialogue because I'm brain, brain off. I'm sorry. And since it's beneficial to attack on the beat, so I need to get more into the sink. The attack button again when your hit strikes is the perfect time. Hmm, that makes sense. And if you need even more help, it seems you have a rhythm assist. But rather than explaining it, why don't you try it out on me? You want me to hit you? I can see it excites you. So please. <laughs> excites me. Attacks on me. What if I don't? If you need help, don't hesitate to chat. I don't want to violence something, even if it wants it. I'm not feeding into that masochism. Not my bag. One, two, three, four. One, two, three.
Just making sure there's nothing up there. That's the defect? Looks suspicious. Robot is licking its crotch. Hey! You looking for me? A little bit of masochism never hurt anybody. I'm pretty sure it did. It was worth a shot. I didn't know if it was like a boost pad or something. Look, I'm sure everyone else did it too. you'd help out maybe this wasn't such a good idea good you made it down here ah uh, so the cat the furry uh, fandom once i saw you fight back there to I hug we might be able to help each other i, I swear uh, security's all over you which i could help you with stop okay whoa, whoa 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 that was you back there you're a cat no this is 808 she is a cat but i built her look like I was saying, you know, I thought my music robot arm power was crazy, but this is, um, how do you hug something so small? I mean, Dude, there are ways. Listen, Vandalay's up to something, and I said I can help. Thanks, but I'm good. Ah, good. Ah, it is going to scream. Okay. I've turned them into an orb. What did you do? Oh, hold on, did you just feel that? That beat? I think we got something here. Look who's back. Andy's got a thanks to 808. Chuck's I didn't mean to hit A. A beat hit. A beat hit. It's a timing based bonus attack at the end of a combo. On the last hit. Watch for the timing circle and press any attack button to land it. Talk is cheap. Let's try it out. There it is, going pro. To land a beat hit, listen to the countdown or look for the two circles overlapping to nail perfect timing. Try a beat hit with your heavy combo. You're on your own with this one. This is awesome! Beat hits are key for doing strong combos and damage. So don't forget to feel that beat. 808, was it? I think we got something going on here. Hey, so offer reconsidered, but... I'm gonna borrow your cap for a little bit. What? Why? Hey, you wanted to help, right? Don't worry, it's just till I get out of here. Better not run off with her. 
So I'm guessing there's like a soul trapped in the cat or something? Seems logical. Staff only. Oh cool! I became staff today, so that means I'm only allowed in here! Art piece. Got it. Talk to your friend Smidge. <laughs> I thought it was just training dubbies. Can I kill them or talk to them? Maybe things aren't so bad after all. Okay. Remind me to ask you later how you did all that. Like I know. Anyway, your turn. I need to get out of wherever I am. You're in production, and the only direct exit is through quality assurance. You see it? So many buildings, it's hard to tell. It's the one that literally says QA Center on it. Ah, oh, yeah. with that shit no. font. But with that way out, they're probably expecting you, so... You had me at way out. Let's go. We got a higher score, higher rank, higher score multiplier. The best solution is the most obvious. That's wrong and terrible advice. You're wanted. We need to outsmart them. Well, then I'll fight my way out. Are you an idiot? That's literally the yeah. opposite of outsmarting us. Hello. Ah. Good day to cause problems is when all of the bosses are here. I'm telling you, that was kale in the flesh. You don't even have flesh. You wouldn't know. Actually being in production, does that count that I met him? No, it doesn't. So get over it and let's fix this staircase. Talkative bots, aren't they? Where we abuse the robot workers. I don't want to abuse robot workers. They have robot feelings. That's a great way to cause a robot uprising. They also have additional robot dialogue. Oh, okay. Hey, quit it! I'm working here! Ah, no, they're New not. Yorkers. It's Monday. Oh, hello there again, friend. Yeah. Uh, hey. I was just looking around. 
and it seems like the whole world seems to be moving to your musical superpowers. You know, I was actually noticing that too. Finding the beat is as simple as looking around. Even the environment reacts to the beat. I think this is what those young people call being in the zone. Maybe? Wait. Anyways, that's cool. I am. I know about the zone. I've seen their animations. Alright, I should probably feed my Snorlax. I think trees do that in real life? Sometimes. I don't know, there's hurricane conditions in the northeast. <laughs> they might. I slid right off. Oh, I remembered something else. Must be really important. With everything moving to the beat, that also means Vandalay's robots. Looking at your recorded data, it seems all Vandalay security units are moving and acting to the same rhythm as you. Which means, by paying close attention, you'll know exactly when attacks will come. On the beat. Okay. Feel the beat to attack. Feel the beat to dodge. Things are seeming quite simple now. Actually, with me with no rhythmic control, it's the exact opposite. Things are getting more complex. One. I got money. <coughs> Ooh. Oh, you look a bit tired. Do uh, I? I think I'm okay. Sometimes it's best to take a rest. By that, I mean a rest combo. After a light attack hits, wait one beat, and then attack again with a light attack to create a new combo. Ah. Uh. You'll know when to press the beat because you'll hear a clap sound. And even better, this combo will take you and your enemies into the air. Wow, sounds neat. But I may need to practice. I hoped you'd say that. Take my breath away. Uh, yeah, sure. I don't... Hmm. Is my advice not compelling? No, I just don't want to beat somebody who willingly wants to get beat. I don't know, that just doesn't sit right in my brain. I know it's a video game. He has gloves. Oh, good! The backbreaker. Oh, did it knock my gameplay into two dimensions? You did. I think I found a shortcut. Yeah, sure. Whoa, this campus is huge. It's more like a city. The perks of being the world's leading tech company. Vandalay likes to show off. But I'm looking for what they're hiding. Oh, you like digging up secrets. How about telling me your name? If it took you this long to ask, you can wait a bit longer. I'm mm. Chai, by the way. Chai? All right then. Oh, okay, come on. Ah, there is a dash button. Yeah, I must have missed that smidge hint. That's fine, I'll just play the game without that mechanic, it's fine. That's like every gameplay commentary channel ever. I don't need this critical piece of knowledge to play this game. I'll figure out a way to do it without it. Oh 
There's a pipe here. That pipe is not available. You're letting him be sad? <laughs> this is a, I'm a thirsty little flower. No! I'm not doing this. I'm quite good not feeding into the first thirsty little flower. Ugh. Ugh. Well, I mean, like... Let's find where it's safe. What? That got flipped, did it? I wouldn't touch that. This apple, probably. Well, you're not dead. That's a plus. I have a battery meter. It actually, it feels like I'm powered up. 808 is showing me you've got a lot of energy stored up in your arm. How about letting it out? Build a reverb cage for your special attacks. Please don't explode. Okay. Seems good. Alright. Yes, I'm not beating you. you seem to be able to now I'm not beating you, Smidge. That literally just happened. Just Reminder, I know a lot about you. I don't yeah. like this relationship we have as friends, Smidge. You really are channeling your energy here. Landing beat hits will knock batteries out of your enemies to charge your reverb gauge. But it seems like all the energy will disappear after a battle. Seems like you aren't built to hold that much of a charge. So remember to use it while you have it. Okay. Like they say, if you don't use it, you live with constant regret over what could have been. Correct? That's not how I remember it. Jesus, dude! Oh, wow. You seem to be able to now use... That literally just... I'm sensing an implication that you must already be aware of my advice. Oh good, big boys. So let's waste them.
Okay. Not bad at all. Crossing end of life anti robotics, we brought some enemies to scrap your models. Damn. Really curious, because if I see an opening, I'm going to take it. Oh. Right, rest pop you up. I don't know if we get it just there or not. Curl. Always go the opposite direction or past any part on conveyor belt. There's always usually goodies there. Skateboard, a vinyl set. Oh, that's cool. An 808 hoodie. Damn. Know what the gamers want. Uh oh. Power's out. Generator looks busted. Could you fix it? Any tools nearby? My fist! <laughs> I got a better idea. Bottom. How dare you. And the beat goes on. Look, I may be a bottom. <laughs> the worst timing! No! Hi, Bulba Garden. How you guys doing? I told you to check that generator. You had one job. Hope you all are doing well. Mechanical engineer, how you doing? Red what were you guys streaming today? We well, someone fixed it, so stop yelling at me. The jig's up. Reckon knows we blew it. I'm sorry, buddy. I didn't mean to get angry. Stadium? Nice. More rental Reno? Nice. I... Haven't played Stadium in a long time. I should probably dust off my cartridges and pull out Stadium. There's some fun times there. Don't get a virus. Yo! 
You look like a man. Uh, I think I won. You gotta break their stun gauge once it's broken. Uh huh. I'm trying to say, wait, that one. Too long, they recharge the gauge. Okay. I mean, this is in the apocalyptic future, so... Ugh. Well, not apocalyptic, but dystopian. But usually they go hand in hand, you know? The apocalypse that is capitalism. You're right, you're right. Uh, hey, I was going for the high score. Not anymore, you aren't. How about combining those heavy and light attacks for even more combos and beat hits? That's what I've been doing. Now's the time to try it out. Time to mix heavy and light attacks. Timing gets a little trickier, but give it a shot. I can do it. See how you handle this one. You are really good at this. Thanks for being very optimistic, game. Uh, optimistic. Game requires tight timing and would fail. You can see it's been very loose with me. But I'm on normal difficulty, which is, you know, very loose on purpose with its timings. There are tighter timings. Uh, thankfully, I didn't go for any of them because I don't have a good sense of rhythm. Yeah, no, uh, I Most here. always was not great at rhythm games. I think the only time I was when I was a bassist for uh, our group of friends that played Rock Band slash Guitar Hero. That's it. I'm sure you could find a special uh, rhythm if you, you know, tried. It's probably one of those practice things, you know? Like, if you did, like, professional training, or not even professional. But like in a hobbyist sense, you could probably get rhythm down pretty easily. I know that was probably meant in jest though, but like I'm trying to be supportive. I don't think anybody has the capacity to do anything. It's the whole reason I did art, even though my art before any of this was dog water. My art recently has been relatively decent because I've just put time into it. I'm a professional, non-professional gamer. Ah. 
but yeah, no, like I've, I've been very happy with like my growth as somebody who's practiced something every day for two years. Put your time in, you'll get there. And in today's day and age, anybody can achieve anything. Anybody can be a gamer. I'm so sorry. You may have destroyed me stack, but my memories remain. Oh, what a good job it was. You must disapprove of my work. Yet, I do not. Please. Humble. I have work to do. Goodbye, stack. Oh, I see. An area I can't get to yet. The wall of fire tells me I probably shouldn't go this way yet. Days without a defect? That's a lot of days. Fire is good. Not for me. I made a flesh. It's fine. You need to relax. Turn this part up. Uh oh, okay. Introducing the head of production, Rico. Oh no. I went from fifty to seventy. Is that good enough? Here you are, man. Messing with Rick's crew. Rick's production. And worst of all, yeah, Rick is perfect. No defect record! Your security tried to kill me! Project yeah. Armstrong, E-U-L-A. Fine print. Should have read it, punk. Defects get recalled! Uh, recalled? You mean killed? Rick ain't picked the verbs! That's for the mooks in marketing. Hell of a word. Thanks for being dumb enough to just waltz <coughs> in here. Rick ain't gotta get her hands dirty. I told you. Welcome to the Project Armstrong defect check, honey. And our QA's the best in the business. Hell! Uh, whoa! Okay. One shot, right? I like defense. That's good. I like how they taste. Oh, that's bad. Inspection level one million. Okay. Let's rock, big boy. <laughs> His hands are extra sensitive for uh, inspecting. Here's a way to say hit them, but okay.
Seems to be good so far. Seems to be good so far. Never mind. Try and dodge this. Oh, I know a way. There's always that spot right there. Oh, that's just a ball AoE. Let me hit him in the face. Time to get serious. Phase three. All right. Okay, he took me out. <laughs> Okay, there was a special kill that I missed. You got a killer track? But every song's gotta end. Revealing his weak point. Ah, okay. Come on, give me a phase four. Give me a phase four. Hmm. Huh? 
Smooch him. rank on it. I'll take that. <laughs> that was phase four. It landed on you. Oh. I got ah. Uh, I got ass. <laughs> How many years is that? Did you see that? Yeah, yeah. But this time, just shut up and follow me. We really got to get out of here. Hmm. No complaining this time. All right, all right. <laughs> Are you scared? What? No. I mean, it is a little dark. Uh... Hey, there are no spiders down here, right? Or like robot spiders? It's a very good loading oh, picture. Don't let there be robot spiders. I'm gonna reduce the volume down to like 50%. Is it? Back to normal volume. Ooh, that was cute. Also, I must have stepped on something that destroyed my sock because there's a giant hole in it now, I guess. Alright. Oh, good, I'm unconscious. We're dead. No, I'm dead. Cool. What are you? Cartoon character? Ten point outline with uh, minimal anti aliasing. So that's where the magic cell shading with only a single type of uh, actual shading. My name is Peppermint. Wait, that voice! You're the cat! 808 is my eyes and ears out there. And it looks like she's taken a leg Aww. to you. Wait, 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 okay, she's yours! She's yours! Get up, slacker. We've got work to do. So, 808 The belt I thought was a cattail. I'm gonna be real. I am. Right after you help me look into Spectra. I don't even know what that is. Don't expect you to. This is whistleblower level. So bad? Yes. And I'm working with a team to expose them. We're small, but- Small meaning just you and your cats? I'm bigger than this. Says Rockstar here. Do you even actually play guitar? I, <laughs> well. Figures, I'll talk. Uh... Look, this wow. surface is a maze of completely bodied and dead ends filled with security. You'll need my help to get out of here. Nah, so far I've done pretty well. Hmm. Horrible if it wasn't for me. Look, if you help me, I'll make sure you get off Vandalay Island. Fine, whatever, I guess. Perfect. Welcome to the hideout. Enjoy some sit down time between missions. Chat up, relax, or take in the vibe. He has a lot of things to interact with. Sit down on the couch to move the story ahead. This is your hideout? You really are a small operation. Well, now we're plus one. You can rest on that sofa. Luxury suite, I see. By the way, I may be able to help you out with some upgrades if you have some spare parts. I have many! I think I've collected every one I could have. Oh, all right. I'm not the master of Vandalay tech, but... With some gears, I may be able to give you a bit more fight. I want damage. Fight. I want more damage. Can you more I want to hurt things more. Uh. I set up a shop for you. Here you can learn new attacks. You can use them just by buying them. Here's your chance to learn new special attacks. Each attack requires a certain amount of reverb gauge, so make sure you have enough before buying. 
Uh, okay. Also, special attacks need to be equipped. You can't just use them all. Yeah. I see. So I'll just slot in my attack and I'm good to go. And finally, here are items for some permanent upgrades. Damage, damage, damage. I've got an idea for something, but let's just say it's still in pre-pro. Damage, How damage, damage. All this with gears? Don't underestimate me. I can do more than you think. All right. Let me see what you got. And just give me more combos, I guess. I want more ground combos. I'm using a lot of ground combos. I probably want more of those. Try. There's left and right. Oh, there's multiple characters. Okay. You can sell them. Uh-huh. Ah, all the things I picked up. Okay. Wall of Fame. jumping in here okay all right uh does the game auto save would assume it does okay so i kind of want to wrap it up here because it's 10 o'clock and i'm probably gonna head to bed uh but we are going to give a raid to the lovely melodic twitch.tv slash melodic who helped us out with some vampire survivors earlier and is streaming some Waka herself. If you guys enjoy rhythm games, boy, I got a stream for you. Never mind, she's playing Tetris the Grandmaster tonight. Never mind, if you like puzzle games, boy, do I got a stream for you. She is going for Grandmaster in Tetris um, the Grandmaster 1, the highest ranking possible. She got it before when she was staying over at my place. Um, but she now she wants to get it on stream. Grandmaster is the hardest difficulty that you can get, the highest achievement in this game. Um, and it's kind of crazy, the prerequisite to get there, and like, what you need to do. It's some high-level crazy Tetrising. But that's gonna be it for me. Thank you guys for coming out and watching. It is always awesome streaming for you all. And we'll be back with Raid tomorrow night for 14. As well as other stuff, maybe. I don't know. But anyway, thank you all for being here. Thank you all for being fantastic. Go say hi to Melodic, even if you're going to go somewhere else afterward. Y'all stay lovely. Y'all stay beautiful. And y'all stay cool. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.